math plus kids does not always equal fun. But now there are an infinite number of math games and toys that make practicing math as easy as pie. But up bum boom. I'm Lizzie, and I love talking with my mom friends about products that make your life easier. I'm so excited to have Coral here. She's a kindergarten teacher and a mom of two. Okay, so which job is harder? Mm, tough question. In parenting, there's no recesses or summer breaks. Ah, true. All right, you ready to count these down? Ready. Okay, first we've got these clever Lakeshore locks that preschoolers love. <laughs> you count the stars and find the matching key to pop the lock open. Very satisfying. And great for number recognition and fine motor skills. Ooh, that too. Next up, I see 10. Players take turns flipping over the chips until they... I see 10. I see 10. This is what I do all day. Now we have Math Link Cubes. These are great for counting by ones and tens to 100, reinforcing Singapore math skills. You can also make patterns with them, build geometric shapes. Just be sure not to step on them. Worth it, sacrifice yourself for math. <laughs> but there are no pieces to lose in this four-way countdown. Yes, this one is a great design and one that my kindergartners absolutely love. <laughs> All you have to do is pop the die, and then you can either add, subtract, or multiply and check off a number. Be the first to flip all of yours up and you're the winner. Good job. Ready? No, I'm not playing with you again. <laughs> now we have some swamp and sums in space. But who summed it first? <laughs> <laughs> this is math practice geniusly disguised as board games. In both these games, kids must solve equations to move spaces. Six minus five equals one. All while running into clever obstacles. Four, five. Yes. I got an accent. I mean, when I was a kid, we only had flashcards. I know. Next up on the menu, magnetic pizza. This is great for learning about fractions. Also comes in a game version too. Only problem is you know exactly what your kids are gonna be begging for for dinner. <laughs> are you a mathological liar? Never. Kids read cases based on their grade level. And use their math detective skills to find out who is lying. I know she's the bagel bandit. They look so good. Next up, Moby Math Tiles. AKA the math version of Scrabble. Why didn't we think of this? I love this one because it gets kids thinking creatively about math and has a range from addition to subtraction and multiplication to division. And it comes in this cute little bag. And finally, Bedtime Math Series. You can get a kid to do almost anything if the alternative is going to bed. These books have really clever word problems with three different age ranges. I love that. All right, guys, that pretty much sums it up. Make sure you check below for our giveaway this week. Thanks, Coral, for coming by and schooling us. Anytime. All right, see you later, guys. Bye. Bye.